This video reviews how to estimate the mean from a grouped frequency table. Now in this table, for example, four people had a score between five and nine. So we have to fix a value for this five to nine, because that's just a sort of approximate spread of values. So we take the midpoint of all of the groups. So between 0 and 4, we call those scores 2. Between 5 and 9, we call those scores 7, 10 to 14, 12, and so on and so forth. So we estimate an exact value for the spread of scores. We've actually lost all the individual test scores and use an estimate for what those test scores probably were. So, this table shows me that there are no people who score 2. So no people score 2, so therefore that contributes nothing to the mean. But 4 people scored 7, so they contribute 28. 10 people scored 12, so that contributes 120. 4 people scored 17, so that contributes 68. And 2 people scored 22, so that contributes 44 to the mean. So to work out the mean, I must work out the total of all of these scores. So 0 plus 28 plus 120 plus 68 plus 44. The total of all the scores was 260. So I've added up all these calculations here. However, there were 20 people. It was told us, however, also 4 plus 10 plus 4 plus 2 is 20. So to find the mean, or at least an estimate for the mean, I do the total of all the scores divided by the total number of people. So 260 divided by 20, which is 26 divided by 2, which is 13. So 13 is an estimate for the mean score on this particular test.